Hey, what's going on, guys? My good stuff here. Back with another video. Finally, I know I've been streaming for a while, but um, I'm gonna share a strategy that I've been wanting to share for at least half a year now that nobody really knows. So this is going to be once my camera panned to the tram. This is going to be the tram strategy. Now you might think, oh, he's probably gonna be camping. Um, no, I'm going to be showing you how to train in the tram. I know, I know. Just, just wait. <laughs> once, oh my god, too much footage, okay. But wait, once <laughs> this camera pans, you will see footage of the tram strategy. Once, uh, okay, yeah. I got too much footage, I know. Um, but yeah, you're gonna want the bootlegger for this one with dead wire. Um, and Thunderwall is going to be super helpful. Um, <laughs> And Thunderbolt's gonna be super helpful for you to be able to do this. So here's so here's some of the footage here. Um, I took them in one minute increments, so if you see cutoffs, don't worry about it. But you're gonna be doing a little U train in the tram, and you're gonna want to have Thunderbolt for other things like that. Just get him out of the way, you know. Um, and that's gonna be super important because in in this you need you, it's like a thunder gun kind of like a mini thunder gun. You kind of need it in this area. Um, and you're gonna want to constantly dead wire zombies. Never have them fully hoard up in the tram. Um, because that will overwhelm you, and you'll be forced to use an in-plane sight. Always have an in-plane sight, and everybody here idolized pop shock, and then it can kind of get you out of the corner. Um, I'm just going to constantly dead wire them, and then once in a while you're going to pull out your M8 and just thunderwall them, when they're, when they, especially when they get too much, when there's a little bit too much zombies in the area, and you feel a little bit too uncomfortable. You know, just thunderwall them, you know? And you're going to be having the tram in the foot... No, oh, what is it? Canal, yeah, the Canal District. Um, the Canal District is going to be the best spawns, I think. And it's where the MA is. MA is just a good gun for that. Um, and it's just going to help you, you know? Um, and then, you, yeah, you said you, you got to be you got to be really confident at training for this, though. You can't just um, walk in and act like you're some big dick man and get it done. you got to um, you got to be pretty good at it. Uh, but... If you're confident enough of your training skills, you want to try something new, go for it. You know, uh, I don't see people. I don't see people, you know, do a lot of fun strategies in zombies. I feel like people just kind of do the best stuff. But this is something different and fun. And if you want to get the sword, by all means, go for it. I don't really care about the sword because um, I forget to use it half the time. But yeah, this is just a really fun strategy. I got to round 56 doing it. That and a Margo round. Um, but it's okay. When you do get a Margo, you're just going to want to run downstairs where the shield is and kind of train it around and kill it. Um, and yeah, it's, it's it's personal preference how you want to deal with that. If you want if you want to build the silver protector to kill the Margo, that's fine. Um, that works just as fine. I actually forgot to do that. I should have done that. Um, but yeah, just build the silver protector. And then the silver protector can actually smash the Margo and, and kill him. So that's cool. And uh, yeah. Yeah, this, this is just—it's such a good strategy. It's just so much fun. Um, but like I said, you need to be confident, and you'll get it done. Um, now for gobble gums, I recommend in plain sight, always, or anywhere here, always a chemical. If you're going to get the apothecan, which I don't—I don't think you need it. If, if you're going to get the apothecan, you want to spam in the tram, or yeah, go for it. Um, get a chemical. If you want to have like your overpowered, stupid ass call, go for it. Uh. But I recommend you throw. I recommend you don't buy widows line. I did in the footage because I, I just didn't think about it. Just throw them all. Throw all the grenades away if you do have widows. Just throw them away. You don't need them. Uh, it's just gonna catch all the zombies up. It's gonna get killed. Uh, but yeah, thank you guys for watching. Hope you enjoyed the strategy video and peace.